Hey Ravens fans, I'm Garrett Downing and I have the pleasure of being joined by Ravens owner Steve Bishotti. Steve, thank you very much for You're taking welcome. time. Good to see you. You're out here at training camp today. You know, you, I've been, you've been out here a few times. What are your impressions so far? Uh, John runs a good camp, you know. He's got these guys excited. Um, new CBA limited our practices. I think the guys are focused. I think they're doing good work. So, yeah, it's nice. Last Saturday, there was an open practice in M&T Bank Stadium. This Sunday, there's one in Annapolis at Navy Stadium. That's your, your area, your yep. domain. Yep. How excited are you about bringing, bringing your team there? Very. It's, uh, you know, when we, uh, when we had to uh, move away from Westminster, that was one of the conditions that I, uh, that I sought. And as long as it was all right with uh, Chet uh, Gladchuck down at uh, Navy, we were going to pull it off. And I, I like the... I like the day and I like the time. It's, uh, it's a great opportunity to showcase Annapolis and get some of our fans down there to come out and uh, uh, five o'clock practice. So I want people to come down and make a day of it, whether it's uh, a day and then end with a practice or come down to uh, Annapolis and spend Sunday night. Mm -hmm. So it'd be nice. Are you planning to be there and what kind of reaction do you expect to get out of the fans? There? Well, you know what? I really don't know. I mean, that, I'm, I'm excited. I will be there. Uh, I'm, I'm excited to, uh, to see how many fans show up. Uh, we've got a nice contingent down in Anne Arundel County and I think they'll take the opportunity to come down. Uh, we know the drill. We know what Annapolis is like in the summer. And uh, so, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. I have uh, I don't have expectations. I don't know whether it's going to be 5,000 or, or 10,000 or 15,000, but uh, it'll be a nice environment and it's, uh, it's, it's nice for our fans down there. What do you think football, to, especially to fans in that area and, and the Ravens specifically, what do you think football and the Ravens mean to fans in that area? Well, I mean, the area is kind of split because, uh, you know, years ago, I guess when I was growing up, there were probably uh, more Redskins fans in Annapolis than Colts fans because it was uh, such an easy commute. A lot of people that worked in D.C. chose to live in Annapolis for the quality of life. And, um, and then you literally came onto the other side of the bridge uh, and from Arnold to Severna Park where I grew up and I, it was all Colts fans. And if you went south of Annapolis, and then it was all Redskins fans. So, uh, you know, the, what, what now with the, with the Ravens, and uh, uh, I think that it's evened out. And, you know, we've got Ravens roosts all around Anne Arundel County. And, uh, and it gives us a chance based on our demographics and the people that come to our stadium. You know, we've got people that, uh, you know, are all over uh, uh, Anne Arundel County. And, and uh, so I, I'm looking forward to seeing, uh, you know, seeing it take place. And I'm sure the success of the last several years doesn't hurt at all. It doesn't hurt, no. It's, uh, it's been great. And uh, uh, like I said, I think that the I think the road system now makes it easier. I think there's a lot more people that work in Baltimore and live in Annapolis, mm -hmm. and so I think that's evened out over the years. Mm -hmm. when, you, when you think about football and you think about this season, there's a lot of talk about Joe Flacco and the offense and what this group can do. What do you expect out of the offense and where this this group could go this year? Well, I, you know, we have a nice offensive group, and I think that we've seen major strides in Joe last year and uh, and this off season. You know, he's a father now and. Uh, and uh, I, I, I see a calmness about him, and I think that's, you know, people say calm, he's always been calm, but uh, uh, I'm, seeing, I'm seeing a different Joe Flacco out there now. I'm really excited about him and his ability to lead this, uh, lead this offense. So I think, I think we can expect good things. I know the preseason starts on Thursday, but we'll play, be playing real football games before we know it. How excited Before we even get to Annapolis, <laughs> we will have already seen them. So Exactly. What, how excited are you just about the season, and, and what do you expect? It's this time of year. You know, we, um, we've been all over Ocean City and uh, uh, in the last month, and people say, are you getting excited for the season? And I try and temper that. It really is the only when the when the mini camps end in June. You've got that six weeks where the coaches get away and the players get away, and it really is uh, – uh, a, a nice downtime. I don't have uh, I don't have answers to anything because the Ravens aren't practicing. So um, I, I look forward to it starting up, and uh, and Thursday night's going to be nice going to Atlanta. Excellent, Steve. Well, thank you very much for your time. And Ravens fans, if you haven't seen the team in action, you can come out and do it this Sunday. Like I said, last open practice to the fans Sunday at 5 p.m. in Annapolis. Steve, thank you very You're much. You're very for your time. welcome. Come to Annapolis. <laughs>